Banjo and the Bushfire. I was taking food supplies to a town far up in the mountains. Whoa, steady on, mate. You almost squished a Coranda tree frog. That's an endangered species. Does that mean they're dangerous? No, it means he and his family are in danger. Like when trees are cut down from his rainforest home. <gasps> That's terrible! You're right, it is. Are you new around here? Yes! My name's Thomas. I'm a tank engine from Sodor. And I'm Tamika. Welcome to the Coranda Rainforest. Our froggy friend here is one of hundreds of animals who live here amongst the trees. Wow, it's beautiful. Sure is. Let's keep it that way, eh? Bye, Thomas. <laughs> what a funny-looking bear! Excuse me, could you please get down, little bear? You're blocking the water. <laughs> what sort of bird is that? G'day, I'm Ranger Jill. There's a kookaburra in distress, and I'm trying to find it. <laughs> That's him! Care to give me a lift? Thomas the Tank Engine at your service. Hop on and let's find that cookie fellow. <laughs> kookaburra. That's what I said. <laughs> Careless campers must have left their garbage behind. And look what else they left. <gasps> Cinders and ashes. Exactly. Leaving a campfire burning could start a bushfire which could spread through the whole rainforest. <laughs> Thomas, we need to be quiet so we don't scare off the wildlife. Oh, sorry, Ranger Jill. Stop here, please, Assistant Ranger Thomas. It's a lost egg. <gasps> we'll take it back to my ranger station to hatch. Ah, oh, what sort of bird does it belong to? <laughs> it's not a bird egg. It belongs to a freshwater crocodile. <gasps> a crocodile? I don't want a crocodile hatching in my cab. 